Hello there again, YouTube. Is once again I, your Gothic host with the most Knox Burzum, back to bring you more blasphemous banter. Today, we're going to be trying out something that I really enjoy using, but probably not everyone who watches my YouTube channel is going to have a use for. That being stated, I happen to wear a lot of makeup. You may notice. What the hell do I get to you use to. What the hell do I use to get rid of it? This. Oil free eye makeup remover from Neutrogena. Effective in general, removes even waterproof mascara and no oily residue. Now, I will admit that when I first got this ball, I was very suspect about it. Um, I've used other cleansing agents like this in the past, back when I was younger, and I was still experimenting a little bit more with makeup and things. And they didn't always work very well, or they were much too harsh on my skin, and they turned my whole fucking face red, or it would burn, yada, 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 you'd have to scrub forever. I want to show you something real cool about this. This stuff is about, I think it's $10 a bottle, a little bit. So you shake out quite well, vigorously. Pretend it's a shake weight. And for anyone who's seen the commercial, you know that's what I'm talking about. Any users. So, as half my shit falls out of the medicine cabinet, because I have a really tiny ass medicine cabinet. So, you take one of these handy dandy little cleansing pads and you shake this up real well. And you just dab it a little bit. And yes, I know there are more expensive cleansers out there and there are probably cheaper ones too. Not much cheaper, but probably cheaper ones out there. I don't know. To be completely honest, we didn't find any. Um, there's probably some bargain brand basement price one in the world, but in all great honesty, this is pretty fucking cheap. And if you really need something that's less than $10 to remove your makeup, should you be wearing makeup? Think about that. Anywho. Also, yeah. Never use pumice soap on your face to get rid of makeup. I've tried doing that before. And I speak from experience when I say fucking ouch. So. Want to see something neat? Three. Two. One. Look at that shit. One wipe. Three. Two. One. Again, one wipe, and like 90% of it's gone. That took me three seconds. Look at that shit, huh? Honestly, are you not impressed? Are you not made happy by that? Is that not a satisfying thing? I mean, seriously. I'll tell you, it sure takes less time to take it off than just to put it on. And then, with just a little bit extra, everything else is comes right off. I've done this by the way with my contacts in before and even if this stuff just mildly touches your eyeball it does not affect your contacts. It's very much hypoallergenic. There are no allergens in it. And boom. Done. There's a tiny bit of eyeliner left on my right lower lid you'll see. But I mean otherwise really I mean the majority came off with one swipe apiece. So, I mean, how much more efficient can you get than that? I mean, really, for 10 bucks a pop per bottle. And in case you're wondering how much skin feels afterwards, completely smooth, completely fear irritation. My skin isn't even wet. Totally clean. Love it, right? I genuinely give this shit a 10 out of 10. It does exactly what it's supposed to do for the exact right price. It has no scent at all. It has no residue feeling at all. And, uh, it 
doesn't even have a poison warning on it. So I'm guessing that if a kid got a hold of this, yeah, you can chug a little bit of it, and probably worst thing that would happen is they puke. That's great for those of us who have kids. I don't, but you might. I don't know. Anyway, if you happen to enjoy wearing makeup as I do, I highly recommend that you go out and pick yourself up a ball of this for ten bucks. Save yourself the money. Go cheap. Go next, Regina. Peace, love, and heavy fucking metal, folks. Goodbye.